all of a sudden, while I was just moving with him, he turned and gave me a punch. All right, um, Valentine Ozo won for good performance today. Thank you. Um, clean sheets, three points, and uh, your team, your team have qualified for the playoff of the Belgian Jupiler League. How are you feeling? Uh, first and foremost, I would like to thank God Almighty. <laughs> I never saw that coming, but. Uh, through dedication, hard work, and everything, I had to focus. It has not been an easy season, quite all right, if I must tell you the truth, but here we are. We've qualified for the playoff, and we are happy. Super excited, talking about today's game, had a clean sheet. I can say it's one of the easiest games I have played this season so far. <laughs> all the same, I'm so happy. All right, now, an incident upon in February, when you were playing a game, and um, you collapsed twice on the pitch. You know, Nigerians got worried. A lot of people start talking about you. What happened to you? You know, and obviously, some funny comments also came up. But <laughs> can you walk us through that that moment? And you know, I've interviewed player when where they told me that even at the moment of them collapsing. All they could think of is getting back on the pitch and play. So mm. how was it for you? And um, I think that was a game against Union. We are playing home. Maybe we are leading 2-0. Quite alright. So that ball was on the flank. So I was trying to uh, stop the, uh, the striker from making a run. Just I stood in front of him. He makes his move, I follow him. All of a sudden, while I was just moving with him, he turned and gave me a punch. Ah, after that, I was thinking, what, what's wrong with this guy? You are leading me to goes to nothing and you are playing better. You had the possession of the game, everything. So immediately I fell down. I, I was thinking maybe, okay, let me act or let me just stay there a little. Because I knew I knew fully well that they're gonna give him red card. So I said, let me stay. All of a sudden I couldn't close my mouth again. It was open. And the doctors they were calling me Val, Val. I will respond. Eh, okay, close your mouth. I can't close my mouth. I don't know what happened. To date, I can't tell you this is what happened. All I could remember was the guy hit me, I fell down. Then I wanted to get up. But I couldn't. Not that I acted, you understand, or trying to make you no. Know. So I was surprised. What is happening to me? I don't know if it's because of the weather. It was cold, but not that cold. I I can't say. But after the whole incident, when I when I was rushed to the hospital, um, he sent me a text message telling me how sorry he was, this, that, that. Even some of my players say, ah. He was surprised, he's not like that. He doesn't behave like that. The following day, he called me again to check up on me. Are you okay? I said, I'm fine. So, yeah, I think I, they gave him suspension five games or seven games, if I'm correct. But I've forgotten about the incident. It has passed. And the next week, trust Nine German now. I was on the pitch again against the shot, I think. Yes, we won the game 3 2. I chose we were leaving for Nigerians to see you back on the pitch. And not just that, now you've gradually integrated into this, um, this Shadaroy team. Now you're now settled in Shadaroy. You played your 12th straight game with Shadaroy yesterday. And, um, you know, how will you describe that progress so far? <laughs> you said I'm settled. I'm not settled yet. This place is not my home. No, I'm not going to be settled. Maybe till I join my maker. That's when I'll be settled. <laughs> um, but I'm glad. 
everything is turning out to be what I've hoped for, what I've prayed for. But this is just the starting point. I know there is more. Just to forget about the things that are behind, look forward for the things that are before. I know there is more and I'm glad that the team, they welcomed me, the reception was so nice, the president, the coaches, the technical crew. So they gave me this opportunity and platform. You have to show yourself. And I'm so happy I utilized it. So how is life here? The language, the, the culture, the food. Uh, it's not difficult for me compared to when I went to Spain because I've got this experience, this exposure. It's not something new. Um, the language, they speak English as well, but French, Flemish, but it's not that difficult for me. The food. I do make my own food, Nigerian man, please, I don't, uh, no, 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 I will cook, at least, if I'm not perfect, at least I know how to prepare something I will eat.